Hello, hello. Hello, good evening. Hello, Jader. How are you? Good evening. I'm fine. Thank you. And you? You're fine. Everything's good. Thank you for asking. Juan Carlos, good evening. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. God How bless you. you. I'm fine. You. I'm great. I'm great. And you? I'm okay. I'm okay. Thank you for asking. Thank you very much for joining. Que responsable is awesome. That is really good. Okay, very punctual. So, Excuse me, teacher. Yes, Juan Carlos, tell me. Le, le, eh, el día de ayer estaba un poquito algo rendido. Me había levantado bien de mañana y, y me sentía muy cansado. Me tuve que salir hoy. Oh, don't worry. That's fine. Don't worry. Oh, bueno. Totalmente lo entiendo. That is okay. No problem. Me All tocó right. sumamente. No había desayunado, no almorcé y solo vine a cenar. Sí, hay días bastante pesados, right? Pero lo importante es que, que descansó, I guess. All right? No. Y que ya se siente mejor. That you're feeling better. That is all right. Gracias, okay. teacher. No problem. And uh, let me see. Uh, Will, with Juan Carlos, uh, talking about the platform, ya terminamos. Ya ver, creo que estaba por la sección número 4, si no me equivoco. No, Le faltaba el examen. Le faltaba el examen no. final, right? Sí, pero ya estuvo. Ya terminó. Oh! Good, very good. Congrats. Okay. So, lo, lo, lo logró terminar ahora. Did you finish it today? Yes, yes. Ah, okay. I finished. Perfect. Okay, perfect. That's totally nice. Okay, good, good, good. Mr. Alvarenga, hello. Oh, okay. Hugo, hello. Hello, hello. I'm sorry. Oh, there you are. Okay. No problem. That's okay. That's good. So, solamente de repente veo el rostro de Hugo, right? Brother, <laughs> what about your picture? Where is your picture? Um, okay. One moment, please. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I see just like, you know, sparks of you or your picture. Okay. But I don't see your faces. Okay, don't worry. And, uh, Oh, there you go. Hello. <laughs> okay, ahora sí lo logro ver. Thank you. Okay. Mayra, hello, hello. How are you? Hello, teacher. Is everything good, Mayra? ¿Está todo bien? ¿Está everything good? Mm, yes. Eh, okay, okay. I hope everything is fine, okay? No la siento Lord. muy convencida. Well, espero que mejore. I really hope it gets better. Miguel, hello. Gracias por unirse. Thank you very much. All right. Okay. Good, good evening. Good evening. Thank you. All right, guys. So, uh, today, vamos a iniciar con la sección número cuatro. All right. We are going to get started with section number uh, four. Okay. Ya algunos estuvieron por ahí. So, you were like in that part. Ya revisamos, ya tenemos una idea, right, de qué se trata. And uh, so, we are going to uh, practice, okay, talking a little bit about uh, section four. That is, well, we get started with some activities here. Allow me just a second. Voy a compartir my screen. I am sharing this. Espero que la logren ver. Okay. So, this is pretty much what you have in the, in the platform, okay. All right, so this is what you have in the platform. So you have, by the end of this class, you will learn vocabulary for talking about uh, things that people have to do, okay? Lo que las personas tienen que hacer, what people have to do, right? So this is exactly what we will be doing today. We are going to talk about uh, your obligations, okay? And the things that you are supposed to do, okay? First of all, let's take a look at the vocabulary, okay? So vamos a comenzar because time is money, you know? So let's take a look at the first. Here we have some activities. Um, for example, we have to stand in line when you go to the bank. So you stand in line. We have to uh, do the laundry, okay? So we have here like do the laundry, taking your clothes, putting them in the washing machine, okay? Uh, travel to work, okay? Uh, go to meetings, um, also exercise. Do you like um, to exercise? 
¿Les gusta hacer ejercicio? Do you like to exercise? Yes, I like. Yes, okay, good, good, good. What about the others? Do you like to exercise? Do you like doing exercise? Mayra, Miguel, do you like it? Yes, I like. Yes, you like exercising? All right, take a look at this one, work in the yard. Do you like to work in the yard? You like to work in the garden, to plant trees? Do you like it? I have grass. Um, I like work in the, with the grass. Ah, very nice, to clean it. So you clean it, I guess. Okay, yes. okay, yes. nice, okay. What about cleaning the house? Do you like to clean your house? Or do you hate it? Do you say, ah, oh, no, I don't like it. Do you like to clean the house? Les gusta limpiar su casa? I don't like. You don't like it, okay. It's what very hard. Oh, it's really difficult, hard. What about open the mail? Do you like to open your mail? I like yes. Revisar el correo, right? Yes? Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay, that is quite fine. Now let's take a look at this. We have this word that says top eight things that people hate to do, okay? So hate is the opposite of like, all right? Las cosas que no les gustan. First of all, I have a question for you, okay? Uh, and that is, what activities uh, do you hate? Okay, so what activities, I'm sorry, what activities do you hate to do? Okay, so que odian hacer? What activities do you hate? Do you hate any of these things? Like, for example, to go to meetings, to travel to work. Do you hate it? Let's I, hate, I hate wash plate. Uh, so you hate to? I'm sorry, uh, Jether, I couldn't listen to you before. You hate? I hate, I hate wash plate. Dishes. Oh, the dishes. Okay, so you hate doing the dishes. Okay, that's all right. What about ironing? Do you like ironing? Planchar? Do you like ironing? Les gusta planchar. Miguel, do you like ironing? No, I don't like it. <laughs> you don't like it. Okay. No, no. Ale, what about you? Do you like ironing? Les gusta, eh, les gusta planchar. I don't yes, teacher. Juan Carlos says yes. yes. Ale, what about you? Uh, no. You don't like it? I don't like it. I don't like it. Uh, Iron, uh, yeah, ironing, planchar, ironing. Ironing. Okay, so you don't like ironing. All right, that's okay, no problem. Now, uh, we are going to check this uh, well, the activities that we have for today is to talk about the things that you have to do, okay? Lo que tenemos que hacer. Allow me just a second here, all right? Les voy a compartir, I am going to share part of the things that we are going to, part of the things that we are going to be uh, doing here. Okay, just a second. Okay, here we go. So let me share this part with you, okay? So this is pretty much what we have. That is the don't have to, okay, and have to. So we are going to check part of the activities um, that we have to do, all right? So let's take a look at this. We have have to. We just have to to express an obligation, okay? So we just have to to talk about the things que debo de hacer, okay? That is kind of an obligation. It can be in present or in the future. Let me show some examples, all right? And like here we have the boys have to study hard, okay? So ellos tienen que estudiar eh, bastante duro, all right? So they have to study hard. What about you? Do you have to study hard? Deben de estudiar también ustedes? Do you have to study hard? Or no, not really. Yes, right? Yes, Okay, yes, so yes, have. yes, we have to study hard. What about this one? Uh, take a look at the following. The board, uh, the board, so maybe this board has to wake up at seven o'clock in the morning. 
So he has to wake up at 7 a.m. Do you have to wake up at 7 o'clock in the morning? ¿Se deben de levantar a las 7? Do you have to wake up at 7? Um, yes, I have. At 7? A las 7? No, no, I have to wake up um. at 5. Oh, you have to wake up at 5. All right. So let's take a look at this. Here, Uso has, porque es tercera persona, all right? Oh. <laughs> Allow me just a second. Okay, but if you remember, uh, usamos tercera persona solamente para he, she, and it, all right? So whenever you have the boy, the girl, my sister, my mother, usamos has to. Otherwise, usamos have to. So the boys have to study hard. I have to study hard. In this case, I have to wake up at five. I have to wake up at four. Y le podemos ir cambiando, right? So me debo de levantar early. I have to wake up early, okay? So, first of all, what time do you have to wake up? ¿A qué hora se deben de levantar? What time do you have to wake up? I have to wake up at 7 a.m. ¿Se debe de levantar a las 7? Do you have to wake up at 7? Yes. Yes. Awesome. Yes. Okay, very nice. That's really good. <laughs> I see Alfredo. Hello, Alfredo. How are you? I see Carolina, I see Lia, I see also CC and N. Victor, hello, hello there. Uh, let me see, let me see. Veo que tenemos uh, more people over there. Thank you. Gracias por unirse. All right. So tell me, Carolina, tell me um, what time do you have to wake up? ¿A qué hora se debe levantar? What time do you have to wake up? I have to... Wake up at five o'clock. Oh, at five o'clock. Okay. Okay, so really early. Okay, really early. Me mm -hmm. too. All right. Now let's take a look at the following, all right? So let's take a look at the one that we have here. Okay, so affirmative sentences, we use subject, then have to or has to, and then the verb, and then the complement, okay? Like I, you, we, and they, we use have to. She, he, and it, we use has to, okay? Let's take a look at this example here. For example, we have, you have to arrive on time to classes, yeah? So you have to arrive, debe de llegar a tiempo, you have to arrive on time to classes. In my case, I have to arrive on time to work. And you too, right? Debe de, llevar, de llegar a tiempo. So you have to arrive on time to, to work. Yes? Now, take a look at the example here. She, he, and it has to. She has to brush her teeth every day. Debe cepillarse los dientes. She has to brush her teeth every day. Also, I have to brush my teeth every day. Yes? So, pretty much, hablamos de obligaciones. We are talking about obligations. Are you following me? Me va siguiendo? Are you with me? Yes. Yes. Yes? Okay, perfect. So, so far, are we good? Or do you have an equation? Preguntas hasta el momento? Or are we okay? Are we good? No question. No questions. All right. Thank you, Yadar. That's good. Now, I will give you um, like one minute, okay? And on your notebook, I want you to write all the things that you have to do in a normal day, okay? So, en un martes, en un miércoles, for example, what do you have to do? ¿Cuáles son las cosas que, aunque las odien, you know, you have to complete these activities, okay? For example, I have to uh, do the dishes, okay? Debo lavar los trastes. I don't like it. I hate it, but I have to do it, okay? So, hagamos un listado, write like a little list, um, write a list of activities that you have to do, aunque las odien, even if you hate them. What do you have to do, all right? So, les voy a dar un minuto. I will give you one minute. Write them, take notes, o pensemoslas, okay? So, think about them, all right?
So one minute. Puedo poner, teacher, I had to start in the line. Hello, Juan Carlos. I'm sorry, do you have a question? Eh, puedo poner, I had, I had to start in the line. I have to study at night. Para la noche utilizamos at. I at. have to study at night. Mm -hmm, that is correct. Okay, thank you. All right, you are welcome. Teacher, yes, how do you arreglar la cama? Make the bed. So you have to make the bed. Ah, okay. Thank you. You are welcome. Are we ready? Listos? Victor, hello, Victor. Tell me, tell me. Perdón, ¿qué es lo que, disculpe, qué vamos a hacer? Yeah, sure, no problem. So here we have an ex, um, the example, all right? So you seen have to. Okay, allow me just a second mm. here. Okay, so here we have like the, the example, okay, on how to use have to and uh, what we are going to do is make a list. Okay, de las cosas que usted tiene que hacer. Even if you don't like to do these activities, hagamos una lista de lo que debes de hacer. For example, I have to arrive on time to, to classes or I have to arrive on time to work. I have to brush my teeth every day. Algo que sea obligatorio, right? So something that is kind, well, an obligation pretty much. Okay. Yes. Are we good? Hacer call in el banco. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Uh, if, yeah, that is an obligation, exactly. Eh, sería eh, queer, queer, queer. A queue. Uh, you can, a queue. you can use the, the word queue, or if you, eh, well, let me share, let me change the screen, okay. At the very beginning, let's mostrar un par de actividades that people normally hate, okay? So it is right here. And number one is stand in line. So you can use Q, all right? Or you can also use a stand in line. This one right here, number one. This Eso sería is hacer cola en el banco. Eso mm -hmm. sería hacer cola. You can use both. Se pueden usar okay. ambas. You can use both. Okay. okay. All right, so everybody, we are going to get started. Victor, I'm sorry, yes. did I answer your question? Veo eh, your hand up, okay? O quedo por ahí arriba. Ah, yes, <laughs> oh, it's okay, it's okay. All right, All right, thank you. Jader, tell me. In Monday, I have to yeah. wake, uh, wake up at four o'clock. I have to cook breakfast. I have to go yeah, to the work at 6. Oh, okay. So you start working at 6 a.m.? No, you... go, go, go from my house to my work. Oh, okay. But you wake up at 4 a.m., you said? Yes, 4 wow. in the morning. Yeah, wow, that's really Only early. Monday. Only ah, okay. Thursday day. But the rest of the days, what time do you normally five wake up? At five. Oh, okay. So that five. is okay. 
That is all right. Good, good, good. Okay, everybody. So listen up. Vamos a hacer grupos. We are going to make groups para que podamos practicar. All right. So you have the opportunity. And uh, let me. Okay, I'm going to eliminate this part here. So we are going to make some groups. Remember the the um the objective is to practice tanto como podamos, right? As much as possible. So take the opportunity, practice. De ser posible no las leamos, but try to say them. Okay. And agreguemos más, add more, add as many as possible. So we will make groups right now. Let's get started, all right? Hello, hello. I see Leah also CCNN. Hello. Are you there? Hello. Hello, Leah. How are you doing? All right. Entremos al grupo, please, so you can practice. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Hello, Mr. CCNN. Hello, hello. Planchar. <laughs> I have I have to arrive on on time to work in the traffic. Okay. I have to wash the dishes. I have to go to meetings. Uh-huh. Okay. Esas son las que yo he colocado, no sé usted. Very good, very good pronunciation, Mr. Alvarenga. That was really good, very nice, good job. Okay, so, intentamos... Este, teníamos, un, un, ajá, teníamos una duda con la pregunta en este caso. Okay. ¿Cómo hacer o sea, preguntas? La pregunta, que debemos, la pregunta que debemos hacer para contestar... Eh, yeah, well, normally, let me share my screen right here so you can take a look at it. Um, because this is have to, the equation normally goes like this. Como estamos hablando de obligaciones, right? So uh -huh. we are talking about obligations. So I can ask this question. What are some activities? Uh -huh. That you have to do in the morning, for example. Mm. All right. Okay. So, what are some activities that you have to do in the morning? Or simply, what do you have to do? 
sorry. Mm, okay. What do you have to do? What do you have to do in the morning? What do you have to do in the afternoon? Or what do you have to do at night, right? And this is like the easiest way. And the shortest. Okay. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay. So what about the others? What do you have to do? Mayra, Vilma, escuche que Alex iba a salir un segundo, un par de minutos, right? So, but let, let's continue, huh? Continue practicing. Very good job. Uh, let's continue. Voy a, a revisar cómo están los demás, all right? Thank you. Thank you. Let's practice. Okay. I, I have, I have uh, two time in the church. Okay. Tiene que estar a tiempo en la iglesia. Yes, sir. Okay. I have, hello. 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 Hi. Nice. Hello. That would be, I have to be on time. To be on time. I have to be. be. I have to. Oh, okay, to be. okay. To be. To be. I have uh -huh. to, be. to be on time. To be. Yes. Uh, to o be. sea, tenemos que utilizar el verbo, el verbo to be. No necesariamente, no. Ah, okay. pero en ese caso, yes. I oh, have okay. to be. For example, be. imagine that I'm talking about the church, as you said. And I say, tengo que estar como quieto, right? I have to be quiet. So, uso el Callado. To be, uh -huh, porque es un adjetivo, right? So, to be quiet. Debo estar callado, yeah? I say, for example, debo estar puntual. I have to be punctual, okay? So, that's the way we use it. But that is okay. In este caso, si usamos el verbo to be, all right? Okay. So, okay. Carolina, Miguel, what about Hello. you? Uh, I have to be quiet. Oh, quiet. <laughs> okay, so like, okay, okay I have to be quiet. <laughs> uh, okay. I have to go, I have to go, oh, perdón, I have to go to work every day. Okay, okay. Y en okay. movimiento, teacher, I have, I have to, en movimiento. Um, I have to move a lot. Debo de moverme mucho. I have to yeah, I have to move, move a I lot. Have, I have to move, move a lot, move a lot in the world. Yeah, that can be. That can tengo be. que moverme mucho en mi trabajo. I have, but remember that I have to me indica una obligación, right? Es yes. como que obligatorio que yo me mueva. Sí, if correcto. that is the case, yeah, that is okay. I have to move a lot. O debo de viajar mucho. I have to travel a lot. O debo uh, de I salir. Have to work. I have to work a lot. Yes, mm -hmm. and I have to work hard. Debo de trabajar mm -hmm. bien pesado, right? Mm -hmm. That is okay. Carolina, tell me. Tell me about you. I hate. I have to work. Oh. You have to. I don't like. I'm sorry, what was that? I have to? Wash socks. Oh, just <laughs> like it. Okay, okay. I don't like. Oh, I, I see. <laughs> okay. Well, mm -hmm. we have to do the laundry, wash and socks and all of these things um, that we don't like. Uh -huh. That's okay. Uh, I don't like. Um, I have, I have to long meeting in my work oh i have to we can use i have to attend okay. i have to attend uh-huh uh, Como I assistir, right? uh, yeah. oh i have to participate exactly uh -huh. in long meetings okay long meetings. okay uh, oh are you God. an accountant i remember you mentioned you were an accountant right yeah. Yes. Yeah, okay, um, okay. Yes, I understand. Uh -huh. And you have to work a lot with numbers, right? Yes. Debe yes. trabajar con números. All right, very good. So let's continue. Escuchamos a Miguel too, right? Regreso en un par de segundos. Uh, voy a okay. escuchar al siguiente grupo, okay? You're doing a okay. good job. So Thank continue. You. Okay. okay. Many people share este, bread with beans and cheese. Teacher, Hello. Uh, we, we we speak about um, we have to uh, cook dinner, but not um, breakfast. But you breakfast uh -huh. take in the work. Oh, okay. So in the morning you have breakfast at work, 
but you have to cook a dinner, you said. Yeah, uh, okay. Rocio, Rocio have to cook dinner. Oh, she has to cook dinner. What about the yes. others? What about uh, Lia, Victor? Me parece que Alfredo no se sentía bien, solo iba a ser listener, right? Uh, but okay. what about the others? My dear, in your pictures, I feel like, you know, only with blocks here, <laughs> okay? Okay. Only with black colors. Share your pictures, please. Así los conocemos tú, right? Oh, there you go. <laughs> Excellent. Okay. Now we see. I mean, I see the name Victor, but I'm like, the king is Victor, you know? So, okay. <laughs> Thank you. All right. So, tell me. Tell me. Uh, okay. So, you have to cook dinner, okay? Victor, what are some activities that you have to do? Rocio, Elia, tell us. I este que I have to play my baby every day. Ah, okay. Very good. Very good. You have to play with your baby. So, what, uh -huh. so I have to eat it every day. Oh, well, yeah, that is necessary. Okay. Okay, good. ¿Qué más? What else? I have study English. Oh, I like that one. Online. Okay. I really like that one. Okay. So you have to study um, English. Okay. I have to watch, watch a, a, in various courses. For example, like the dishes. Pañales. Clothes. Oh, yeah. oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> well, really? Okay, okay, that's yeah. that's nice. Okay, very good. Okay, very good, very good pronunciation. Uh, I didn't have the chance to listen to Rocio and, uh, and Leah either, but uh, Rocio, tell us, Leah, tell us one of the activities that you have to do. Well, I have to go uh, early to my work. Okay. Uh, I have to do all my homework. Okay. And I have to advance in the platform. Yeah, you have a really bad teacher, right? Okay. <laughs> she gives you a lot of homework. <laughs> okay. Okay, very good. Uh, very good pronunciation. Tell me. Otra sería, I have to go to the supermarket. Mm -hmm. Very good, that's okay. I have to take the medicine. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, that is excellent. Very good. Very good pronunciation, everybody. Very good use of grammar. Nice. Okay, vamos a volver a la, a la conferencia principal. All right. Allow me just a second here. And here we go. Hello, hello. Okay, me faltan todavía un, a couple. Oh, there we go. Okay, excellent. Okay, it was, um, it was really nice listening to you. Okay, excelente pronunciación, excelente uso de gramática. Very good. You're doing a really good job. Now, let's continue with this part, okay? And uh, I want to show you something here, que es la parte negativa. No hemos revisado preguntas, and we have not checked negative sentences. So vamos a revisarlas here really quick, okay? And uh, vamos a comenzar with the, the structure, okay, with the easiest. First of all, don't have to. ¿Cuándo utilizo don't have to? Don't have to tells me, uh, and I want you to pay attention to something here that says, when something is not necessary to do. Okay? What does it mean? When I say don't have to, no le estoy diciendo que no lo haga, all right? When I say don't have to, 
what I'm saying is no es necesario, okay? Um, like, for example, uh, teacher, tengo que completar eh, el 100%, let's say, y solo necesitan un 90%, for example, okay? So I can tell you, oh, you don't have to, no tiene que, all right, it's okay, there's no problem. If you tell me, for example, uh, or if you talk to your boss and you say, boss, and tengo que venir el sábado, do I have to come on Saturday? Y su jefe le dice, no, don't worry, no es necesario. Oh, no, you don't have to. So don't have to is when something is not necessary, okay? So es bien importante eh, to get this part of don't have to, porque no es algo que le digo, no lo haga, all right? Sino que no es necesario que lo haga. Take a look at this part, okay? We have, for example, the children don't have to go to school today. Don't have to. Ellos no, no es necesario que vayan. They don't have to go. It's Saturday, yeah? And they don't go to school on Saturday, all right? Take a look at this one. She doesn't have to eat all the fruit, okay? So, well, it's a lot of fruit. No es necesario que lo haga. So, she doesn't have to, okay? So, doesn't have to me da la idea que no es necesario. Now, let's take a look at the structure, okay? We use a I, you, we, and they. So, with these ones, we use don't, okay? I don't, I don't have to, you don't have to, we don't have to, they don't have to. And third person, you already know what we use. So, the example that we have here says, we don't have to get up early on Sundays. So, no es necesario que me levante temprano el domingo. I don't have to get up early on Sundays. Pero si yo trabajo domingos, oh, I have to get up early. So, es la diferencia, right? Now, uh, the other one that we have is tercera persona. She, he, and it. So, when you, we use them, we are going to, uh, the negative form is doesn't. She doesn't have to uh, get up early on Sundays. My brother, o sea, he, yeah, my brother doesn't have to get up early on Sundays. Are you following me? Yes. 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 Si el, sería he, yes. He to get out every Sunday. Okay. Leamos el ejemplo, right? Uh, he doesn't. He doesn't. Uh, he doesn't. To, usamos acá. He doesn't. Y luego no hago ningún cambio con el verbo. Remember, terceras personas no puedo. Eh, I'm sorry. Cuando tengo un auxiliar, aunque yo tenga tercera persona here, no puedo cambiar el verbo. All right? So, si usted tiene un he doesn't, no le vamos a agregar S. All right? In this case, he doesn't, no le puedo agregar has, sino que tengo que usar la forma base. So, he doesn't have to get up early on Sundays. El no es necesario que se despierte temprano. All right? Are we good? Yes. Preguntas, do you have an equation? O sea que... Eh, él no es necesario que se levante temprano el día sábado. Eh, Sunday, eh, los eh, domingos. Eh, domingo, domingo. Mm -hmm. Perdón, 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 perdón. But yeah, you got it. Exactly, de eso se trata. That's, that's it. Very good. Miguel, tell me. Y solo perdone la pregunta que le voy a hacer. No, don't en worry. La plataforma, Go ahead. En la plataforma que, que, que estamos en esta lección, ¿cuál es, teacher? Es la, la parte 4. Hablo un poquito de, de hate. Y menciona un poquito la parte de have to. Ok. Hey. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, ya llegamos por ahí, Miguel. Todavía no. Sí, teacher. Yo, bueno, yo tengo ya, ya todas las... Ya me apareció ahí el, 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 el diploma. Ah, ok. Perfect, perfect. Sí, podemos revisarlo, right? You can check that part. Hay una sección donde están las actividades that you hate to do. Y también hay un poquito de esto, all right? Ok. No perfect. problem. Está bien. No, sí, sí. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so let's take a look at this. Vamos por el momento a skipear la parte de questions. Ya la vamos a re revisar. Okay. But it's pretty much the same thing. A simple present. So you use do and we use does. Okay, to make questions. Um, okay, first of all, let's take a look at this. We have here um, a little exercise and this one says order the following sentences. So you have, for example, clean your room, have to, you. So we are going to 
put each of these words in the correct order, okay? So I will give you some minutes. Take a look at these three exercises, okay? Y los comparamos in some seconds. So I will give you two minutes maximum, okay? Hagamos el ejercicio, please. Order the following sentences, all right? So if you have any question, let me know. O también tenemos la opción de chat, right? So you can uh, type your equation over there. So two minutes. Hello, hello. Are we finished? Yes, yes. finished. Okay, yes. Per perfect. That's awesome. So let's take a look at the first, okay? Uh, clean your room, have to you. So what we have here is, oh, I love me a second. Okay, so the answer should be, you have to clean your room. Are we good? Yes. Okay, good. perfect. Sure. The second, this is a question. Las preguntas las iniciamos con do, all right? Do they have to play football? Have do they have to, to play, play football? Okay. Yes? yes? Okay, good. Next one says, I don't have... Don't have uh, my brain. My bed. Hey. Bye, bye. Yeah, solo que le falta el to. I'm sorry about this. Mm -hmm. I don't have to make my bed. Le falta el to acá la parte. Have to. I don't have to mm -hmm. make my bed. No es necesario que yo haga la cama. I don't have to make my bed. Okay, very good. Now let's take a look at just one more here. Okay, and let's put them uh, in the corresponding order. Okay, do the dishes, has to, and she. Katie, primero, what is first? She, do, she do, has to do the, the dishes. She has, she to, has to, to do, do the dishes. Do the dishes. Do the dishes. Very good. She has to do the dishes. Do the dishes is una forma de decir lavar los trastes. Yeah. Y um, wash the dishes. Mm -hmm. Also, it is possible. Yeah. Mm. Take a look at number five. Es una pregunta. Las preguntas las comienzo con el auxiliar. In this case? Dos. Das. 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 Does he have to cut the grass? Tiene que cortar la grama, right? So does he have to cut the grass? Um, and we have this one right here. She has to 
Has she to has to study, study every day. Every day. Every day. Every day. Every day. She has to study every day. Very good. There you go. So from these activities, ¿cuáles son las que ustedes odian? Which are the activities that you hate? The four. Four do the dishes. Do the dishes. Okay, so you hate to do the dishes. That's all right. Me too. Me too. What about number five? Mm -hmm. Four and three. Four and three. Okay, let me go back to number three. Oh, made the bed, really, Dilma? <laughs> okay, so you hate to make your bed? Okay. What about play football? Do you hate to play football? ¿Alguien odia jugar el fútbol? I no hate, hate, I but don't, hate don't like. Oh, no, you, you don't like it. Okay, you don't like it. What about clean your room? Do you hate to clean I your room? I have, and I have uh, clean your room. Okay, podemos usar I have to, like yo te puedo, all right? I have podemos to. Usar, yo odio, I hate to, dependiendo of what you want to say. So Juan Carlos, you have to, usted debe de limpiarlo, you have to clean your room. Uh, yes, así es, no me gusta. Oh, you hate, <laughs> you hate to clean your room. Ale, what about you? I don't have make my bed. Oh, you don't uh, you don't have or you don't hate? Uh, how? Oh, you don't have to make your bed. No es necesario que haga la cama. Oh, no, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, lucky you. Okay. Look at you, very nice, okay. So, ella no es necesario que haga la cama, right, Ale? Yes. Ah, okay, very nice. Creo que le envidiamos. I think that we do. Okay, um, now let's take a look at just one more thing here, okay, that is complete with have to, has to, don't have to, and doesn't have to. Ooh, I'm sorry, I showed you the answer already. For example, number one, uh, Zara has to study hard for the exam. Ella debe de estudiar. Mucho, right? For the exam. Take a look at this. David, what can we use? David has, has to clean, clean his room. Uh, his room. Doesn't, doesn't have to. Dave, oh, podemos tener más de una posibilidad, um, right? Have to, to, has to, don't have to, doesn't oh. have to. What do you think? Has to. Have to. Or oh, doesn't have to. El debe, no. like he has, has to. to. Has to. Or has to. to. Okay, let, let's take a look at, oh, he has to. Pero mm. también se podía, eh, what you say, like he That's doesn't it. have to. Él no tiene que. Mm -hmm. That is mm -hmm. also possible. Number three, logran ver la tres. Can you see number three? Yes. Okay. Yeah. So number three says, cut the grass every Sunday. I have to cut the I grass every to. Sunday. Okay, let's take a look. Okay, very good. I, I don't have, have to. to. Oh, you don't have to, okay. Well, I don't have, there is no grass in my house. So no es necesario que la corte, right? I don't have to do that. A four, Andres, to play football after class. I, I have to. Um, Andres? I have. Has to, has has to or doesn't have? Doesn't have to. Mm -hmm. Okay, Andres has to, has to or, como mencionaron, Andres doesn't have to play football. Very good. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Excellent. What about the last? You have to. You have to make you your bed have, every day? Uh, don't have. You, don't you have, have to make. Ambas funcionan, both are fine. So you have to make your bed. Debes de hacer la cama. Or, no debes de hacerlo. You don't have to make your bed. All right? So both are possible. And that is quite fine. Um, do you have an equation with that? Right. Uh, Mr. Alvarenga, tell me. No, no, no. Sorry. Oh, okay, okay. That's all right. So, uh, is there any question? Tenemos preguntas. Do you have any question? No. 
No questions? No questions. Okay, very good. So now, what we will do is this. We are going to make groups one more time y vamos a compartir two things. Number one, las cosas que you have to do at work, las que deben de hacer en el trabajo, and number two, las cosas que odian hacer en el trabajo, all right? So what I have to do and what I hate to do, all right? So the idea is, is to practice, so no es necesario que las anotemos. Ya escribimos algunas anteriormente, right? So right now, solamente intentemos, try to practice, okay? Are we good? Yes? Yes. Okay, nice, excellent. So talk about the things that you have to do at work and the things that you hate to do at work, all right? So we will get in group in one, two, three. Here we go. To do at work. ¿Qué yeah. debemos hacer en el trabajo? ¿O qué, ajá. ¿O qué nos gusta hacer en el trabajo? Y la segunda sería What hate to do in the world. ¿Qué odiamos hacer en el trabajo? Sí. All right. So podemos mezclar everything. What you love, what you hate, y lo que debe, lo que es obligatorio, right? So that is okay. So tell me. Uh -huh. First, mm -hmm. por obligaciones. Let's start with the obligations you have. I have to practice. Like you have to keep record. Debe de mantener un record de los impuestos. You have to keep a record of taxes. Yes. Ah, okay. Keep a record of taxes. That's okay. Thank you. Alguien más? Anybody else? Yeah, I have to arrive early at work. Yeah, me too, me too. I understand that. Okay. Anything else? Algo más? Do you have to send emails? Do you have to talk to customers? Do you have to take phone calls? Uh, what are some of the activities that you do? <laughs> Ale, tell us. Que no se dio por... Oh, talk about your, your daily activities. So, ¿qué es algo que debe de hacer, uh, for example, at the office? Okay. At the office. What do you do, Ale? I have to write um, emails. Okay, okay. I have a, I have to get up early okay. in the morning. No. Okay. Yeah, that is a, a really good sentence. And do you like it or do you hate to get up early? Do you, do you like it? Mm, yes, I like it. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's okay. <laughs> Uh, Dilma, what about you? Do you like to get up early? No, teacher. Y me toca levantarme a las cuatro. Oh, at 4 a.m. So, ahí utilizamos el hate. I hate to get up early. Okay. Wow. Uh -huh. That's it. Okay, very good. So, sigamos platicando. All right. Voy a ir a compartir con el otro grupo. Let me check how they are doing. All right. Sigamos. Okay. Try to share, okay? Compartamos ideas. And... No me pongan la foto. <laughs> Él dice, and do, and, uh, in do, no like to see the, to the photo. I don't like. Hello. 
I'm sorry. I, I didn't. I, uh, yeah, I, I didn't listen to that one. Juan Carlos, can you repeat, please? And don't lie. Mm -hmm. To see, they do not do the photo. Uh, I don't no like. No pongan to... la foto, que no pongan la, la cara. Ah, okay. Maybe I don't like to see my screen. Okay. Ah, Great. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, but it's okay. That's okay. Uh, Ceci, what? A, hello, Ceci. Hello, there you Peter. are. Tell us, Ceci, what about you? What is something that you like or you hate? Uh, intentando, teacher. Uh -huh. Yeah, sure, sure. Please go ahead. Uh, I hate, I hate not mm -hmm. being understood. Oh, okay. In Spanish or in English or both? Uh, in Spanish. Oh, okay. And in English? <laughs> in English. It's okay. Future, in future, me van a comprender. En el oh, futuro. okay. I like it. That that's the correct attitude. Very good. Really good. Okay, nice. Uh, Miguel, Carolina, what about you? Tell me something that you have to do. Obviously, also um, something that you hate to do, etc. Okay. You tengo aquí. I I hate. Uh, I hate to get uh, my attention. Attention in group in a group. Uh, okay, so you don't uh, like to to get people. To get in, oh, okay, okay, okay. My, that's okay. No me gusta que me llamen la atención en el grupo. En público, uh, okay. En público, sí. Okay. Like que lo siempre. regañen or something ah, like that. Regañen. Yes. Uh -huh. Esa es ah, la forma okay. de. Okay. Pero so, sí, se vale de todo, pero okay. es so, una forma de expresar ahorita. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Uh -huh. It's okay. Uh -huh. It's okay. That's fine. Y tengo otro y, también y si que yo dice, pudiera... Perdón, perdón. Sí, perdón. está bien. De, go, go. Go, Juan Carlos. No. Go. Y si yo puedo, digo, I don't like being in the traffic. I don't like being in traffic. It's okay. That's fine. Being. Que no me gusta. No me gusta. No me gusta estar en el traffic. Mm -hmm. That is good. Being. 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 I don't like being in traffic. I don't like I don't like being in the traffic. Yes, there you go. Okay, okay, very good, exactly. Okay, excellent. Um, allow me just a second. Déjenme ver cómo van el siguiente grupo. Okay, and continue, continue practicing. Eh, cobrar, no sé, pay, pagar. Hello. Tenían problemas con Hello. cobrar algo? No, es que estábamos diciendo que I hate work. Pero si oh no trabajo, God. no me pagan. <laughs> If I don't work, I don't get Entonces, paid. Uh, tendría uh, problemas para, para cobrar. Okay. <laughs> yeah, if I don't work, I don't get money. Okay. Yes. I don't eat. Okay, that's okay. Eh, ¿Todo bien? ¿Is everything good? ¿Lograron practicar? ¿Were you able to? Yes, um, so, algo. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Uh, that's okay. Your questions, do you have any question for me? Oh, todo está bien, is everything good? Bueno, solo eso, ¿cómo se dice cobrar? Eh, por el ejemplo que me da, like, if uh -huh. I don't work, sería, uh -huh. I don't get paid, no me pagan. Pay. Ah, pay. I don't get I paid. Don't get mm -hmm. I don't get paid, paid. yes. Okay, good. Okay. So, allow me just a second. Vamos a volver a la sesión principal. Okay? Very good job, okay. everybody. Nice. Thank you. Hello, hello. 
Mm -hmm. Okay, so I guess everybody had the, the opportunity, right, to practice. Um, I listened to your examples. They were really good, very good pronunciation. So that is okay. That's really, really nice. Um, ¿Tienen alguna pregunta para mí? Do you have any question for me? No. No questions? No questions. Oh, okay. Lo, lo, lo único que sí le puedo decir, lo, lo que yo vi más ahorita, ¿Ya? la niña que puso ahí con los ojos igualitos los míos. Uh, ah, okay, okay. Igualito, in the, in the presentation, todo. okay, in the PowerPoint presentation. Okay, con los ojos azules, right? Okay, that's okay. Okay, everybody, uh, thank you very much. Gracias por unirse, all right? Um, I, tr I truly appreciate it. Eh, antes de despedirme, eh, parte de la sección 4, para los que ya lo completaron y los que no, pues ya van a llegar, en, eh, hay un poquito de pasados. No sé si ya revisaron la parte, de si completaron eso. Eh, los yes. pasados es necesario, es fundamental que ustedes se memoricen los verbos, right? De lo contrario, no puede, es bien complicado que hablemos en pasado sin saber eh, algo, al menos los verbos básicos. So, les voy a compartir una lista de verbos. Tomémonos el tiempo, por favor, para memorizarse esos verbos y para que podamos hablar un poquito más eh, fluidamente, right? Que no eh, tengamos que ir al traductor. So, gracias a todos. Thank you very much. Les envío en un par de minutos la lista. All right. Okay. And okay. have a good night. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.